guys, it's Maya. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And as you can tell by the title of the video today, I have some very exciting news. I finally got a camera. I mean, well, I haven't been posting on YouTube that long, but I wanted a camera so bad because when I was shooting videos, my phone was always running out of storage. So I just went ahead and invested in a camera. It shouldn't be that surprising. I got the Canon G7X Mark II. I chose to get the Mark II as opposed to the Mark III because I heard the Mark III have a lot of issues with focusing and stuff like that. And it was more expensive. And I heard the Mark II was like overall better. So I got the Creator Kit as a lot of people do. So yeah, full disclaimer, if the stuff is not packaged like correctly it's because i already did this video when i first got the camera which is like a few days ago um and i don't know i just wasn't feeling the energy of that video i wasn't in a good mood so i just decided to redo it so yeah let's get into the video not only did i get a camera i got some other stuff for the camera and other accessories which i'll also show okay so I have the box with the camera and then I have an extra battery and then I have this little this tripod that came with it this tripod is so good I like this tripod a lot better than this gorilla tripod because it's like so flimsy don't mind the flower on this it's from a cooking video i did and i need to wash it off which will probably go up before this video so but both of them are pretty good i recommend this one too this tripod i also really like because you can push this and it moves all around all around town y'all that's crazy so in the creator kit it came with the tripod i just showed a SD card that's 32 gigabytes, which is already in my camera, by the way, and an extra battery. So I have two batteries. So yeah, here's my camera. It looks, it looks so good. So let's just open it. I'm such a good actor. I'm acting like I haven't opened this before and shot a video on it. Anyways, let's keep going on. Okay, so what came in here was the little charger in this battery and the camera, of course, and the little manuals and stuff, but don't nobody read them. I mean, it's I've taken photography before, like as a class, but it's a fairly easy camera to work. I feel like it's pretty self-explanatory, but so here is the camera, y'all. I'm sure if you're watching this, You've probably seen videos like this before, but this is what the camera looks like. It looks so good. It looks so good. The focus on this is so good. I love it. And then this little flip up thing where I can see myself. I love this camera. So... I'm not going to get into the little the specs of the camera because honestly, I don't remember. I would say that I do recommend it though because I've used different cameras before and I do really like this one. And I think it's a good vlog and film camera because big YouTubers, usually they have different cameras that they vlog and film on. But I think this is a good camera because it can do both. It's pretty small and yeah, overall. I would recommend it. This is so random, but I like this little red detailing that it has. My favorite color is red. So I just thought that was pretty cool. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the other stuff that I got for the camera. And then I'm gonna insert a clip of me filming with the camera instead of my phone. So you guys can see the difference. The first thing I got was this little adapter to adapt to my MacBook. So I can plug in my SD card because you know macbook pros they only got like those two little plugins so i had to get one of these 
And then I got this silicone case for my camera, which I'll actually show you guys what that looks like on. So this is what it looks like with the little case on. I love it because you can turn it on and this little thing just pops out. And when you turn it off, you could just pop that right back in there. I feel like this was so cool. I really wanted a red one of these, but I could not find one. So I just stuck with black. So in addition to this little silicone case, I also got this harder case, uh, which I've already dropped. It was over my carpet, so it's, it's, it's fine. But I was like, oh, yikes. So this is like, it also has a strap on it. So like if I'm out and I'm vlogging and the last accessory I got for my camera is this standing tripod that you guys are on right now. So I'm gonna take you off and show you and then I'm gonna do a side by side of my camera and my phone camera. So this is the standing tripod that I got. It's your average standing tripod, so I'm sure there's not much surprise with this. So excuse the fact that I'm probably gonna be looking at the two different cameras back and forth, but obviously it's not the same exact angle, but it's kind of a close angle. So yeah, this is the difference between my phone and my new camera. Um, yeah, I still think that my phone is still really good quality, but more so it was just the issue of always running out of storage and wanting a camera anyway so yeah i just felt like it would be better to just go ahead and make the choice so as as you could tell by the smile on my face i'm super 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 excited um yeah so the quality of my new videos about to be so good so yeah, I mean, I don't really know what else to say except for the fact that I love the camera and to be on the lookout for new content. Okay, so it's only right for me to close out this video on my new camera. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and turn those post notifications on because I post every Tuesday. Thank you for watching. Bye.